New game! Welcome to St. Pid Pigeon Nation. Please enter your name. New name. My name is Big Dick. No, no. Oh my god. Y'all no fun. Fucking fine. So we don't want to fuck a bird then. I guess we're doing the human versions. Okay, fine. Figuration saved. Now we can start. St. Pigeon Nations, a school blessed with extensive curricula and facilities. I can't read. It's already been a year since I ended my ordinary life and walked through these gates. I should probably say this school is known for one particular thing. This school is Japan's, no, the world's greatest gathering place for gifted birds. The teacher, staff, and student body are both made up of a diverse blend of birds of different backgrounds and species. I'm often asked why I chose to come here despite not being a bird. It's a long story. Not every day I see you rushing along like this. Oh my god! Ryota! Usually you have been ready for an hour by now. Oh my god, we're getting smitten by a fu Is this Reiji? See, now thanks to you- Oh my god! Oh wait! Wait! He's kinda cute! This rock dove is named Kawaru Ryota. He's been friends since he was barely hatched. Oh! He can be a little mischievous, but he's responsible and kind. Breakfast was a little hard to catch today. I can't relax without red meat inside. Oh, the bell already? Come on, we have to hurry to class! Jeepers! No good being late on the first day. Oh no, we can't be late on the first day. And so, Ryota pulled me along into the school. Today is the start of the new semester. I wonder what lies in store. Good morning, everybody. Err, I'm Nanaka Kazuaki. I seem to be your teacher this year. Cool. I specialize in math and <laughs> physics. And also, other things. Sleep. Mommy is simping. I am not simping for a fucking bird. Uh, sir, wake up. It's homeroom. He sleeps with his eyes open. Oh, uh Oh! He's a quail. This quail is Nanaki Kazuki. He's a famously saporific math professor. I had heard rumors, but I hadn't expected him to fall asleep just like that. Oh, me falling for a bird? No, the fuck I'm not! Apparently, he's well known as a mathematician. Just goes to show. Great minds come in all forms. Please introduce yourself, Shirogane. What's the point? Is this the type I think it is? Oh, <coughs> it's that way. <coughs> I have no wish to speak with commoners. Do not think I'm here because I wish to be. Oh, is this some fucking rich bitch? You could at least say your name, Chirogane. Oh my god, it's a rich bitch! Ah! It seems this fantail is Chirogane Sakuya. His feathers would make any birdie proud. He's pretty stuck up. But then, transferring is never easy. I hope we can be friends. I'm scared, guys. Lunch already? Today is slipping by so quickly. That reminds me. I've had these books out from the library all summer. I'll return them now. Oh, oh, the library. We only know what goes down when there's a library scene. Where is everyone? Is someone looking at me? Probably just my imagination. Or not. A morning dove stands in the corner, staring in my direction. Did you want something from me? We got a silent one here. Are you sure? Yes. I don't want anything with you. Aw, don't be mean. He glances at the desk, as if to say, hurry up and return them already. <laughs> He's shy, booty. Were you waiting for them all summer? He silently returns his gaze to his book. Yer. Hello! Fujishiro Nageki. Freshman. Oh. <laughs> Oh, he's really cute! Morning doves are pretty rare in Japan. Oh, he's really cute. Leave me alone. Oh, oh my heart. I'm so glad we put the human versions because I because they're really cute. Oh god, it's Mr. Rich Bitch. You should have been instructed not to approach me in school. Uh fuck your mom. <laughs> Come on, Sakuya. What kind of thing is that to say to your own brother after all these years? You must be joking. You've never once been a brother to me. Please don't talk to me again. I have no time for half breeds. I'll be going out. Oh, some fucking little rich bitch. Oh, we got some family drama. You heard the whole thing, right? Are you a friend of Sakuya's? <laughs> no. I I'm sorry. I didn't mean to listen any on you. <laughs> no sweat. Oh my god. I try to stay sexy and suave in front of all of you little ladies, but that there wasn't too cool. Oh my god. <laughs> I am not simping for a bird! 
this fantail pigeon is Sakazaki Yuya, an upper classman. You fucked me with the glasses and the shaggy hair. You fucked me up, bitch. You know that's my type. I've never talked to him before, but he's famous and infamous throughout the school. Every birdie knows of him. Did you say you were a friend of Sakuya's? We had a rather ballistic introduction this morning. We're in the same class. That's all. Uh, sir, where's Ryota? He said he was going to the infirmary. Maybe you should go and see if he's still there. I don't wanna go. They've got all kinds of drugs in here. El Prele, Typhi, Elysio, Benzene. What do you even do? I don't know. Care to find out? Oh, I, 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 <laughs> I'll feed. Oh, uh, uh, what? I'll feed you all sorts of things if you want. I am. Oh, no! No! You cannot fuck me up with a man like that! No! The partridge is Iwaminishu, the school doctor. He's rather creepy. You mean sexy? I don't know about y'all, but when they're like like that, I, some hoes may think it's creepy. I think it's sexy. Um, carry on, sir. It has a bad reputation among the student body. Bro, I'm legal. Come on. You don't look like you have a good reason to be in here. Did you need something? Uh, I heard Ryota. Kawari from 2-3 uh, was supposed to be here. Him? He's already gone. I never got around to joining a club last year. Why do we want to join clubs? Just go home. I'll start with the track team. Fuck track. Do I look like someone who runs? Cool, cool. This is no pudding for a man. What? Okasan rejects it. It is a lie, a vicious falsification. He's dancing around on a squished pudding. Uh, hey, uh, that's not very nice to the pudding. Wait, what's the pudding? Uh, oh, does he not have a human form? He doesn't really look it, but supposedly he's a feigned tail pigeon. Either way, he's hyper. I can tell. Oh, he's a true bird. Okay, betrayal. Cut. Okasan instructed that pudding be provided for new members. Spare these jests, young lady! Okasan used wing attack. It's super effective. They'll rue the day they crossed Okasan. He'll have them flayed, hanged, and shot at dawn. He will. Excuse him, what? Okasan must now train to achieve true pudding. Farewell! As you all know, this school doesn't require you to join any club. I already hold a position here. And what is that? Oh, that's right. You became student president when you were admitted. Nepotism. Oh, we didn't get a vote. Join the. Should we join the student council, track team, or the library? Wait, what about be a doctor's assistant? Like, wait, can we not? So library it is. Today's an elective day. What should I do? How about music class? We sang birdie melodies. It was a little tiring, but singing together is fun. Ami leveled up. Charisma increased by five. Cool. When do we get to see the hot doctor? Nagaki, when did you? I've been here all along. I never noticed. He's almost as bad as the doctor. You're thinking I have no presence, right? It's okay. I already know that. No, baby, no. I am not simping for a bird, Aqua. I swear to God. You certainly seem to like this place. Yes. Is that a problem? No. Books are nice. Uh, why don't you join the library staff, Nagaki? You could read whatever you want. I already read whatever I want. You shouldn't slack off, Miss Receptionist. Fucking okay! Wow, what a change in scenery. Ah, sitting at home is relaxing. Wait, wait, do we live in a cave? Today's the sports festival. I never did make up my mind. What should I do? We are gonna be first aid assistants! Salutations. Did you come to gaze into my eyes, Monami? Not you. Alas, burned for the sake of medicine, I won't. I must work harder to prove my love. Fuck off, bro. Where's the doc? Yeah, where? Where's the doctor? He's resting in the shade of a tree, some distance away. It looks like he's taking notes on the performance of the birds on the race. <gasps> Go to the. I know where we're going. Y'all don't gotta tell me that. You again. Are you like, yes, doctor, I'm so sick. <laughs> I'm not exactly, bitch, come on. Why are you here? Oh, ah, this game is going how I like it. I'm here to hear your voice, of course. This game is going how I like it. <laughs> my voice, yes. Oh my God. <laughs> yes, you sound like Snufkin? What the fuck? And 
Um, I want a radio. Don't tell me you came here just for that. Oh, would it be bad if I did? <coughs> You're even stranger than I had thought. I'm fascinated. How I'd love to experiment on you. Please do. Oh my god! Sadly, I am busy at present. Please go elsewhere. Uh, what? No! I got kicked out! Today is Tanabata. There's probably a bamboo tree in the plaza this year, too. I think I'll go make a wish. Can you hear a song of the stars above? May they send you happiness, Monami Yuya. I'm not trying to fuck you, okay? Just who will be granting my wish and how? Iwamine Shu. Oh, oh, I will grant your wish. This is the doctor. I know his name is Shu. I'm, I'm right here, baby. Shu, I am... I am right here! We get our finals back today. I'm not sure I did too well. Yoshiko, well done! You've gotten even better. Keep up the good work. Oh, today's the last day of school? It's summer now. I need to get all the assignments books before I go home. There will be a lot of students coming in to borrow their summer reading pretty soon. Are you here, Nage? Please, quiet in the library! <laughs> uh, I was wondering if you were here. Of course, I'm always here. What do you like to read? Smut! <coughs> you volunteer to work here. So you must like books. Do you want me to recommend you something? He not. A night on the Galactic Railroad or Ho Orehato? The first one I saw was Orehato. Uh, it's a light novel that came out last month. It's about an incredible tsundere. It's about an incredible tsundere Nikobar with a complex and her faceless male protagonist brother. I see. He sounds extremely uninterested. Oh no! Today is the local summer festival. I think I'll go with, with some booty. Fuck the doctor's not on here. I guess I'll have to settle for some other birdie. So I guess we will do Sakuya then. Oh god. Asakuya over here. Oh, this pretend. What? It was the pretentious birdie? You got the nerve to call me out during vacation. What is it? I don't want him. Today's the festival. Uh, let's go together. Festival? What's that? Uh, you'll understand when you see it. Come on. Shops, food, good fun all around. People can't possibly be eating food prepared like this. It's it's unsanitary. It's madness. Guiding the panic-stricken Sakuya around the festival. Oh, so are we like humbling him a bit? Sakuya around the festival is a little troublesome, but hilarious nonetheless. Uh, good morning, everyone. I hope you all had fun over summer. Uko-san is always having fun. Of course he is. What is this fun? Did we not just have a beautiful summer romance? at the festival did we not just bond over fucking chips and candy apples what do you mean what is fun did we not just have a justin timberlake 2008's vibe summer romance summer love a uh, good more what is going on here the classroom is filled with a cloud of dancing feathers it's molding season well one little breeze and it looks like this unless we make sure everyone's cleaning oh my god this atmosphere is quite distracting. Who was supposed to clean yesterday? Oko-san! You were supposed to clean? Wretched mongrel! Can't you even fulfill the duty it's given to you? Today's the school festival. Our class decided to do a maid cafe. I'm not scheduled to work until tomorrow, so I have the day off. Oh, why do we keep bumping into the fucking teacher? I wanna fuck the doctor! Maybe if you trip, he'll come and get you. I will- no more sexy doctor. I will gladly trip myself. It looks like the crowd is thinning out a little. That was tiring. Are you okay, sir? I'm fine. Just a little- Hello? <gasps> oh, speak of the devil! <laughs> Mr. Nanaki and Dr. Iwamin. I hadn't expected to see them together. Okay, um, Mr. Nanaki, um, you can fucking go. There is a static deviation visible in the data on students for the past few years. I had hoped to get some sort of insight from you. It should seem I've overestimated you. Really? Sorry, I couldn't help then. I'm a little biased. Uh, the doctor. You should look more clo- Oh no, wait! I don't want to be mean to the teacher! No! I'm sorry, Mr. Nanaki. Hello, Yoshiko. I'm sorry, yo, I didn't mean to be a dick, okay? Even the students dis- <gasps> No! Even the students disrespect you? Pathetic. Okay. Just cause you're hot doesn't mean you get to act like a fucking dick, bro. Mr. Kazuki, I'm so sorry. Fuck. Um, sir, I, I gave you my recorder earlier instead of my homework. Oh no. So you did. Here you go. Oh, now I feel bad. Here's the workbook. Thank you, sir. Like teacher, like pupil. That totally softened my hard dog. Fuck you, Shu. You are a 
jackass! I don't want to fuck you anymore. I am angry! I feel... Betrayed! You know what? We gonna cheat then. We're gonna fucking cheat. Just cause you hot does not mean you get to act like a dick to people. I'm sorry. No. Fuck you. Oh, no! A fucking son of a bitch. No! That's not very nice, doctor. <laughs> Hello, Yoshiko. What is it? He still says it anyway. Fuck this bitch. Fuck you. Which brings us to our main topic, the observational reports on the human representative at St. Pigeon Nation. As you can see, while she was meant to act as a goodwill ambassador, she fails to display sufficient intimacy with a bay? Wait, so are we legit fucking birds? We of all the hawk party cannot overlook the situation. These reports only confirm that we already knew of human nature. We will execute termination sequence, adjourn coffee, anyone- wait, what? I was watching the stars at night. I can feel the excitement bubbling up from years away. I think I just heard something. Huh, who's there? Ninjas? You don't need to know. It'll be over in seconds. Yeah, what's happening? <gasps> it's a sad thing that your adventure have- Wait, what? Did I just lose? What the fuck just happened? Are you kidding me right now? I am sad, cause I, as soon as he was a dick to me, my heart on softened. No, no longer simping. I don't give a shit how hot and sexy you are. As soon as you're a piece of shit to me just one time, it's done, bro. And that's how it should be. For anyone listening here, I don't care how fine that cake is. I don't care how fat those titties are. I don't care how loud those asses clap. If they a dick to you just one time, walk away, bitch. This is my TED Talk. Thank you for coming.